Hello everybody, I am Brandon 19 and welcome to episode 24 of our Malacca campaign in Europe Universalis 4. So, right now we're getting ready to start shifting troops off and out of the way. As they are moving up to here. We'll need to go land over on uh, Majatin or whatever it's called. This place way over here. Let's go ahead and transport troops to there. Legalism, give me more admin. 100 Leyte is now done. Let me see about that. Um, Leyte, you are now done. I want you to go move your troops to here. Converting heretics around too. All right, we're now working on three provinces. Getting ready to take these guys on here. Might be able to make them into like a vassal or something far across the ocean. That's not a super big deal. There you go. By Cole. Great advisor has been... Uh, has died. Let's give him a national unrest guy. Eight seven seven. Let's keep moving. Come on. Go to the next spot. Split in half, send one guy north. 100 population on El Fuego. Going in there, we'll waste a few troops doing this, but uh, to get the uh, go ahead and wrap it down would be the best thing for it. There you go. That require more than that. Um, steer your trade. Okay, um, let's get a few more. Okay, Kutai. Okay, let's take... That and that for sure. There's Malaya, that nice purple color. Okay, we'll do that. Um, let's get these troops back. Pretty 
Great advisor and our employee is done. Morale of armies. Let's get this merchant man. Yeah, whatever, just walk him back. I'm not going to worry about that much. I mean, look at that. That's beautiful. Not quite done. Not exactly to the point I want it to be. Some more things that can be done. Like, we're going to sit here and do these, if we can get them. There's Kageon. Which I believe is this guy, yeah. Next one done, we'll go here. Up, oh, they rose up. Go ahead and put those guys on there. Keep it going. I just really want to knock out some of, the, some of these little things. Both of those are done. B. Cole. Come on, guys, let's hurry it up. Okay, get another one going. You're sitting there at 9.07. Sending another. Yeah, just using Propagate Religion to keep our religious movement going on. Here for you, fall go. We 
we call the guy from there. Send a guy to Daru. Karima. Yeah, we're quick to snatch them up now, aren't we? Call from Daru. Send her there. Yeah, I'm keeping this guy here. Didn't even start my golden age for this, by the way. Hmm, where's my, uh... Oh wait, they're all waiting way off over here. Come on back home. I wasted some more there. I mean, just some more money coming in later on. I mean, that money is doing me no good just sitting in there doing nothing. One, two, three. That's gotten closer. Let's go ahead and do this. Recruitment time. No big deal. I want to finish this off. Cost me twelve twenty two fifty to uh, upgrade that. I'm still not ranked. That's crap. I have one of the highest developments. Matter of fact, I have the third highest development. I guess my rating's not there for whatever reason. There's Ottoman Malaya. Spooky, okay. Some Portugal Portuguese territory there. Up oh, Spanish has started that, so they're in the Solomons.
Again, there's really only one, two, three, four that I want. There we go, new. Forcing religious unity. Tax modifier. Put that in the treasury. Okay, we'll upgrade all these ships. The two deckers. Okay, looking good. Let's see if my estates can give me a quick thing. I know I haven't tried it in a minute. I think I could do anything with it. I could do uh, seeking their support. Uh, doesn't really give me anything. Let's increase their influence. Global trade power up a little bit. Got a little bit more of an increase for these guys. They're up to 120. Some of these can go into their trade company, some cannot. I don't know how I'm going to get that. I'm trying to figure that piece out. It wasn't telling me. Come on. Let's finish it up, guys. I know we're close.
914 in Fak Fak. Uh, Manak Warrior at 901. Next highest after that is going to be Yos Sadarso, which is right here. So now I'm after only three because the Spanish have taken another one that I wanted. Come on, give me some lucky rolls or something. Goes fact fact done. Didn't even realize that somebody rose up against me. Okay. Let's go ahead and go take care of this guy. Goes Manakwari. We go, we've got them all claimed. Let's do one twenty five. Gal back to me. I guess that. Let these finish off. Do want to get these core, these uh, final cores down here done. Okay, looking good. All right, looks good right there. I could probably do some more states, but that's just going to upset me back. Let's go ahead and speed up time a little bit. Okay.
Okay, looking good. Almost got all that. Quarantine that province. We're down to three colonies right now. They're all about 420 to 550. Let's get it on down to 106. On one more month. Okay, two more left to go. Imperialism is now a thing. Yeah, we'll do Portugal. Get 93 more and we'll be good. Portugal is no longer a valid rival. Let's name France then. Let's go ahead and annex this guy. Go ahead and get Cebu annexed. Okay, one more month and I'll have all these done. Still waiting on three more colonies. Yep, still waiting on those three. Uh, let's do this. Admin efficiency. Asian Dragoons. All right. Um, could make more states. I'm just not going to. I'm going to go let these things finish up. There's one of the three. There's now one more left to go, and I've got it. Go ahead and check to see what achievements I have. Yeah, just two more. There we go, and then there goes Madang. All right, so that's going to end it right there, guys. Let's take a look at Malaya. We stretch from all the way over here. We've taken these islands. We've got Keta as a vassal. I could never push an Ayathaya. If I would have worked earlier, I probably could have done more here. All the way up here, I almost got exactly what I wanted here. Just didn't quite make it. Um, Cebu's in the process of being annexed. Uh, the Ottomans and Portuguese took two provinces that I really badly wanted. And uh, everywhere else it looks just fine. I mean, everything was right what I wanted it to. I have uh, two, or excuse me, three colonial nations, Malay Cascay, uh, technically Malacan Caliph, and then I have Malay Austre. So, I mean, I did pretty well, I feel. Um, I'm not going to get the you know what I deserve here in the uh, great powers, but technically I had the third greatest power in the world. If you look at it closely, I mean... I would be behind the Ottomans and Spain and just ahead of Ming. Maybe I don't get that rating because I'm not, uh, you know, up there with them or something. I don't know. 
Um, in seven more years, we would have had a new institution. But uh, anyways, go here and take a look at our achievements. We did get, you get a new home and you get a new home. Expel five different minorities to your colonies. Pretty quick and easy. Uh, just find, you know, you just have minority provinces and then send, expel them to a different colony. It's not, uh, to a def different colony each. It's not too bad. Um, and then the spice must flow. We must form the nation of Malaya, which was the core of what this was about. And we nearly got that done too. Uh, really wasn't anything else out there, um, you know, to do. If I look around, I mean, I'm just looking through these. Not really anything through here. We almost made the first circumnavigation. It was very close. I came in second by like months. Oh, we got hard bargaining. As defender of a Muslim faith, propagate your religion to the Moluccas through trade to con uh, convert five provinces. So I did get that. Didn't even realize I got it. Didn't ever shift it down. It's weird. Um, there's full house. Have three vassals and two marshes at the same time. I kind of almost got there at one point. Um, let's see. Own all institutional origin provinces. Nah, not quite. Uh, da, 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 da. Anything else that we were close on? No, not really. Um, maybe eventually I could have gotten this manpower thing if I would have kept taking over some more, but it's not really all that important. But let's go on and go look at... Doop, 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 doop. Where is the... There's the timeline. All right, as we start as this little bitty guy on the tip here, let's just go ahead and push through. You see as we took over parts of the strait... That was very, very, very aggressive early on, knocking out lots of guys. I mean, it's barely even 1525 and I've got both of these done and a lot of this. With Brunei and Kutai, here we go getting some of Australia. Yep, there it goes. Here we go in like the final bit here, just grabbing every little thing in front of us. Yep, there we form Malaya. Took over all that, not bad. And then here's the world throughout the game. Those of you who are interested. Pretty standard so far. There's been some well, some weirdness with Burgundy, it looks like. The Ottomans growing pretty good. Poland grew weird. Spain grew, you know, stayed right in its little zone and did a lot of colonization. Russia took it, taking over some Sweden and Denmark by the looks of it. Yeah, okay. Not really much of a much going on throughout all of it. The Burgundy did come back somehow. There's still a Brittany out there, still the Ottomans. Janigar, Pelotana, and Delhi are still fighting for here. I mean, not too bad. Could be much worse. Looks like, you know, the, the, you know these powers all kind of... I mean, if you look at South America, Portugal, uh, the Dutch, Britain, and uh, French all kind of halved up South America pretty well. Um, I could have done more here, I'm sure, and, knew, you know, and taken over and had my own little Spanish colony. But, you know, I, had, I went for California anyway. So, all right, guys, I'm going to go and end this one right here. I appreciate you all so much for making this such a great and amazing campaign. All of your support was awesome. We had some great gains, and I look forward to doing the next one with you guys. So uh, don't be afraid. Uh, go ahead and to, uh, make sure you like, subscribe, and comment if you haven't already. Go ahead and go check out Discord. It's in the link in the description below. We'll be talking about this and the next upcoming campaign. And uh, I will see you all next time.